So that's who won the World Series. Oh, hey there, Nostalgia Nation. It's me, John, coming at you again to discuss yet another Ready Player One teaser clip. That's right, I assume we're about to get yet another look inside the Oasis and uh, another look at the very many recognizable properties therein. So join me. Also, Patron of the Day shout out is gonna go to Austin Moore, so stay tuned after the video for your shout out, buddy. All right, let's do this. <laughs> this is the Oasis. It's a place where the limits of reality are your own imagination. Not bad. People come to the Oasis <laughs> for all the things they can do. They stay because of all the things they can be. I'm here talking to all of you now because our future is being threatened. Uh. I just came here to escape, but I found something much bigger. Wow! Than I found my place. <laughs> <laughs> Interesting. Another slow, another slow, somber cover version, but instead it's of the Pure Imagination song, which, hey, I mean, that that's that's fitting. What can I say about this trailer? It looks like a Ready Player One trailer for sure. I like that this time around we're getting a bit more of the themes instead of just, oh, look who's here, look at this guy and that guy. You know, it's nice to actually get uh, some more of the themes of this story, at least in voiceover format. At this point, I just want to see it. I'm a little tired of trailers for this movie <laughs> because each one is kind of the same to me. I get what the stacks look like now. I get a little bit more of what Oasis is like from this trailer, but I kind of understood, I feel like, already. Um, I do like that we get a little bit more of the glimpses into what the Resistance is doing outside of the Oasis. You see them actually like driving around in what appears to be real life and what appear to be the real life stacks coming down. So that's cool. That's something uh, newish. And uh, my man, the Iron Giant gets a, a whole like featured shot in this trailer, kind of reminded me of the movie itself, which I'm sure is intentional, although Dean's workshop is nowhere near as state of the art as this one. Dean. Uh, but you know, that's one of my favorite films of all time, so I am excited to see that. And for all you video game connoisseurs out there, I caught some of the Spartan warriors from Halo. That's pretty cool. And it looks like maybe that DeLorean's gonna get to do uh, a little more than we expected. There are a few different shots and it's definitely cool to see that riding through the snow in hot pursuit of something. I feel like this is gonna become like Lord of the Rings or something by the end of it. Just like a video game, intellectual property, spanning, epic battle movie of some kind. And uh, more Spielberg, you got a T-Rex in here and you also got King Kong in here. Every time, just, just adding some more characters. Got, gotta love it. Gotta love that familiarity train. Gotta love familiar things and ideas. <laughs> Caught Lena Waithe in this trailer, that's cool. And uh, you know, I, I'm curious about this movie. I'm, I'm honestly a little skeptical just because I know how much you can get by on nostalgia these days. And this movie is like a nostalgia gasm and coming from page to screen in a way that's truly memorable is a hard thing to do. And this movie looks expensive. Yes. I am rooting for it, but I am also kind of worried about it just because I, this is not a guarantee for me. <laughs> Pretty much every trailer 
trailer is just nostalgia, 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 and action and CG and nostalgia. And, uh, you know, that's cool. I haven't read the book yet, so I, I don't know exactly what to be excited for beyond the basic gist of this. Maybe I'll listen to it beforehand. But you know what I'm definitely going to do is I'm definitely going to give a patron of the day shout out to Mr. Austin Moore. That's right. Austin Moore is a pretty badass animator doing Star Wars Lego type of stuff. And uh, you know what I want to see, Austin Moore? I want to see a complete film remake of Ready Player One. Once it comes out, I want you to remake Ready Player One as a Lego movie with the Lego Iron Giant, with the Lego DeLorean. There are so many kinds of Legos that I feel like the only other way to do this would be to do it with those. Cause you know, like Lego has the rights to everything and apparently so does this movie. So uh, yeah, do, would, you, would you get on that Austin Moore <laughs> making demands? of you even though it's your generosity that helps us be here. And as always, you can subscribe to The Real Rejects, click that notification bell to get notified every time a review or a video is out. Patreon.com slash The Real Rejects is where you can find our exclusive community. We got tons of exclusive content over there, music video reactions, TV show reactions, full length stuff, Q&A, a whole bunch of great people. Come join us there. And also don't forget to check us out on the Stardust app, download link in the description box, follow us first, helps us out. And as always, guys, ch-ch-cheers.